Heard of a lot of good stuff came here and saw a lot of bad. I'm actually standing in what used to be her door before a car crashed through her business. And she says that this isn't the first time it's happened. We have fine pieces of furniture that can never be replicated. Hours wow. before the store's doors were set to open. I was awakened to a phone call from ADT telling me that I had a glass break and that there was motion. A driver crashed through the business near 47th and Vincennes, leaving a gaping hole. I called the police. I come from South Shore, and I got here before them. Benito wow. Vince owned the consignment store, a lot of good stuff, and got here moments after the crash Sunday morning. When I saw the guy moving around and he was standing in front, I knew he, he didn't have any ill intention, that he was actually a victim in this situation. She says the driver who wasn't hurt showed her this dash cam video from his vehicle. The video shows the moment police say the driver was trying to avoid another car on 47th Street when he veered right, plowing through sturdy glass and metal, <laughs> leaving Phipps with thousands of dollars worth of damage. And they need to put something here so this won't happen again. Now, for the second time. You know what? What needs to be done is that they need to put some pillars here to keep corner business is safe. It hasn't only just happened to me. Now, this is my second encounter. However, a store right on the next corner on St. Lawrence, it happened to them this summer. So, yes, I suffered some major damage, but it is just stuff. A lot of good stuff, but it's just stuff. And police say no citation was issued. In Bronzeville, Trey Ward, ABC7 Eyewitness News.